Mike Warburton, congratulations Thank through you. to the Thank third you. round here at Lakeside. You didn't make it easy out there, but um, I suppose a win is no, a win. He didn't make it easy. He didn't make it easy. That, that was that was a thing. I'm still a little bit excited, so you have to forgive me. Um, I just knew that that I said to the wife before the game. I said this is going all the way. This because Dave is such a dogged competitor. He just doesn't know when he's beaten. Thought he had him a couple of times, and then all of a sudden he'll have a little flourish, and. Yeah, just it was one of them. Like it was back and forth, back and forth, and then the leg, the second to last leg, I had an absolute shocker. And then uh, I was like, "Come on, get your head together." And those two one forties forced him into a little mistake. He had a forty-five, I think. And then when I was on that seventy-eight and he wasn't on the finish, I thought, "Come on, I fancied it." I thought I, I knew I was going to take that out. To be honest. It was one of those games where every opportunity and every mistake was pounced upon. Yeah. We saw a 164, we saw a 160 from from Dave, and obviously the double-double 96 from yourself as well. Yeah, yeah, there was some great finishing in that game. And yeah, like I say, I, I think I won the game in the other room for the bullseye. You know what I mean? That every set went with throw. And yeah, I think I won the game in the other room, throwing for ball. I mean, seeing what Dave's been producing of late, we saw him at the seniors, we've seen him in these WDF events. He's been producing some really good darts. So you must have felt just going up there that this is a tough opportunity, but it's an opportunity you've got to take. Of course, of course. He knows what I'm about. I know what he's about. and We've played pairs in the Welsh Open. I, I know what he's like. He's, and the thing was, he, ca he carried me a little bit in, in the Welsh. And uh, yeah, I, I just knew what I was in for. I, I, I sort of prepared myself for that type of battle, and yeah, luckily I come on top. Come out on top. Sorry. How much has the the work you've been doing in the on, on live league and things like that helped you here? You've been playing so much over the last two years, where some players haven't had the opportunity. How much has that helped the preparation for this? Oh, massively, massively. I, I can't say enough about the the online league. It's 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 a such a great platform. It's getting bigger and bigger. But it's it's run so well. All the lads involved, I love them to bits, and I'm lucky to be involved in it. You know, and like I say, it when you're coming into tournaments like this, playing against top top opposition like that, week in week out, every month, it it does prepare you for for games of of that magnitude and of you know, like that game went, pressure was on, and I just managed to just hold my nerve in the end and. Ping that double top, and I was relief more than anything when I when I hit it. To be fair, we've got so many debutants here this week, and I've asked this question plenty of times. But what is it like just walking into Lakeside and seeing that stage for the first time? You know what? It's phenomenal. This I I haven't even, I've never been to Lakeside to spectate or to play, and I come here early. This, I was like here at nine o'clock. I was banging on the door. Like, can I come in and just just have a look at the place? Because I've I've grown up watching Lakeside and it's so iconic and yeah it, it's it's an honour and a privilege to be on that stage where all my heroes have stood and to win my first game dream come true. Congratulations once again, Mike, and we'll see you soon. Thank you, mate. Thanks very much.